today's video, today's video is going to be about my outfit and I have decided that I will be doing a OOTM which is outfit of the month at this point. Once before I was like I was going to do an OOTW which was outfit of the week because I see a lot of um, ladies doing the OOTD and um, no offense or badgering on that behalf. Do what you do. And, but um, I want to kind of switch it up a little bit and be a little different. So I think I'm going to pick one outfit out of the month or either out of the week and do a video on it. Um, the day this outfit was kind of random. I thought about doing it this morning before I went to class, but then I was like, no, not this outfit. But then I got a couple of compliments about it, so it's just something simple. It's not nothing fantastic with a lot of jewelry. I didn't wear any makeup today, but people told me that and I looked it nice. So I said, well, this is an opportunity for me to do a video about what I'm wearing. Okay, we're going to start with the hair. Now, I did my hair um, again this weekend. If you looked at my previous video, I flat out my hair about two weeks ago to do a limb check because I am transitioning and I like the process. I've been using glue and I like the glue, but you just have to take care of it. I'll probably talk about that in another video. I'm not going to get into depth about that because that's not this video. That's another video. So, but anyway, my hair is Milky Way. I never had this time before. It was 2 inches, 16, 14. I paid about $25 for it. I don't really like it, but I'm going to keep it. These earrings I got from the hair store for a dollar. If you watch my previous um, Jerry Hall video, you'll see that I'm cheap. <laughs> I don't like to pay over a dollar for my jewelry, so I it, I will, but I got to really, 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 really want it and think that it's worth what the price that I'm going to pay for. So anyway, this is just a regular yellow and white tank top, and it came from Walmart for $3.88. These pants, which are some baby fat pants. I had been eyeballing these pants for a while but when they first put them out I didn't get them because they was a little too pricey but they went on sale. It has a little belt and this is that really thin cotton and it has the pockets. I hope y'all can see. I like pockets. I'm a pocket type person and um they are like cord on them. Is that what you call it? Quarter limb? I don't know. They come past the knee, but they're not quite at the ankle. And they're not wide or uh, uh, nothing like that. And um, I got these for, I think, like $14, you might as well say. Um, I like them. They look kind of big, but I think how they made, they really supposed to fit you tight. So, when I'm being baggy, I think that's a good concept for the type of pants that they, they are. So, um, I think they look okay. They probably wrinkle too, so don't laugh. I had this on all day since like 9 o'clock this morning. It's like 6 something in the evening, maybe 7. So, I know they made wrinkles because of the material that they made out of. And my shoes. <laughs> compliments of rugged they're yellow with the little bold rugged warehouse um i used to work there i love rugged warehouse they sell name brand stuff they used to have a lot of inexpensive stuff which is right up my alley but i've had these shoes for probably about two years i, I know about two years i keep my stuff for a long time i try to take care of all of my stuff and i think i pay like six dollars for them shoes they, they were cheap <laughs> um and that's about it i didn't wear no makeup no no excess jewelry and none of it it's hot now so it's just 
all that stuff is just too much and in the daytime unless you're going to a nighttime function where it's a lot cooler and you're going to be in air conditioning then you can like be doing all the makeup and stuff but I just I didn't do that today and that's about it um I am listening to a CD if y'all can hear it playing in the background only got one song playing and it ain't going to start over to a song stop but that is the way it's his hair soundtrack for all of y'all ladies who have not heard this or have sleeped on this, I know it's old, but you you got to listen to it. It's so soothing. There's a lot of artists on there that I never heard of before. Just hearing them on the soundtrack is like the only time. But I'm an old school fan. I'm a ride or die old school fan. A lot of stuff that is out now, I like. I ain't, I ain't gonna front, but. Not as much as old school. Like all of the CDs and stuff that I make are usually between the eras of the 70s and the 90s. I like like Freddie Jackson, Luther Vandross, Tina Marie, LTD, The Whispers, um, The Delphonics, you know, Frankie Beverly and Mays. You know, so if I'm on my computer messing with music most of the time, that's what I'm listening to. Jody C. Stuff like that. I don't know. To me, after the 2000s, I don't know. Music just lost its own. Um, you know, I ain't, I ain't flexing on it because I do listen to it, but I don't know, y'all. But enough blabbing. But if you haven't heard that Wayne Six Hair City, you need to. I think that you ladies would like it if you just. It's something that you can clean up to it. Just mellow out to Drink your bottle of wine or a cup of wine or. Whatever you do to relax. I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you want to. If not, then that's cool too. Bye.